I read about an Asian lady who was 90-something years old, I believe, and she said she always used jojoba oil on her face at night. And I started trying it, and I was like, this is really easy to do, and I do think I like the way it makes my skin feel. So I run out of my oils that I usually use, so I'm going to make another batch. And I have just got a small jojoba oil bottle, and this is the Now brand. There's other brands, and there's probably several that are better, but this is non-GMO, and it's pretty good. So I'm going to use this today. Um, I am going to put tea tree in it. I'm just keeping it on my, my item, so my hand's going to be in the way half the time. But I am going to put... One, two, three, four drops of tea tree. I am going to put, now myrrh is a thicker oil. And actually sometimes my lid sticks because it is a very viscous oil. So I am going to put like five drops of this. No, that's what a drop was it. Myrrh is good for the skin, and it is good for wrinkles and to make your skin look younger. I'm going to put frankincense, hopefully about 10 drops of frankincense. Oops, that was 11. <laughs> Geranium is good um, to make skin look younger, good against wrinkles. And that was five drops of geranium. Tangerine is an oil that tightens the skin. Hopefully I have enough in there if I can get it out. Okay, it's not coming out. Let me try that one again later. Vetiver is good for, for against wrinkles and tightening skin. I'm going to put just three drops of vetiver. Sometimes they're hard to come out. Well, maybe they're lower than I thought they were. Try the lavender. Lavender is healing, a very healing, so is frankincense. I'm just going to do five of lavender. And lemon is a brightening oil and cheering and cleaning and all of that. I'm just going to put like a couple drops of lemon. Because what I'm doing is experimenting, and I will just see what it smells like and see if I like it. And then if I like it, I will keep it like that. If I want to make it smell a little different or if I think something's too strong, I'll just add more of another oil. So I've actually used several. They don't always recommend using that many for a blend, but each one of those is a very good product for the skin. So I am going to... I'm going to go back and do the vetiver and tangerine, but I'm probably going to do three drops of vetiver and five drops of tangerine, but I'm going to have to, it's low, so I'm going to have to take my little cap off and work on it. But I just shake it up, kind of get it dissolved good, or not dissolved, but mixed in good. And then when I'm ready to use it, I just put a little bit on my face on my hand and rub it on my face but right now I am going to just see if it's strong enough rub some on my hands and smell it and then <clears throat> sorry I'll let you know <clears throat> sorry about that I'll let you know if I like it 